it's been so far, and tonight we drop the puck on game number four. Welcome back to EA Sports. A lot of bounce on both blue lines here, and we are about set to drop the puck here at center. This is what you play for. Moments like this, you can feel the energy in this building, and we are underway. Oh, the tracks it perfectly in the offensive end. Monster save by Allen. I really like to save James because he challenges the shooter who's all alone in the slot area. He turns aside a real dangerous opportunity. They gain possession here inside the neutral zone. On the attack along the boards. Quick feed to Suzuki. And he takes the feed. Moves it to Suzuki. Here's a shot. Denies him. Well, the shooter's in a coveted spot on the ice, right in the middle of it with a good look. And he makes an incredible save by getting square to the puck and turning it aside. Kakadin's going to hang on for a whistle. Lots of time left in this period. Still no score in this one. San Jose is going to start with the puck in their own end. Oh, and that's poked away in the offensive zone by Cooley. The Canadians get a hold of the puck along the boards. Here they come inside the neutral zone. There's a collision. Some players get into the game by physically engaging early. There's a fine line there, but that was executed perfectly. The Sharks have to be feeling good about themselves. They have been pushing and pushing to start this one. James, they're emotionally charged as they're at home, they're playing their opponent, and they started right from puck drop, and that emotion was transferred or channeled into their feet because they've been all over the ice with their legs under them. Knocks the puck away on the open ice. Sends it in front, and that's intercepted. Montreal's got control of the puck. Tried to get 2Q with it and loses possession. But he's got such a slick set of hands. He's trying to manipulate his opponent one by one, but he tries one too many, James, and he loses the puck. What a hit against the wall there. Here's a blast. Tremendous sacrifice laying out to block it. Here's a chance on the attack. Stops him with a glove. Nearing the midway mark of the period. 1-0 is where we sit at this point. The Sharks win it in the defensive zone. Moves it quickly over to Carpenter. The Canadians gain control of the puck. Slides the puck ahead into the neutral zone. Picked up along the boards by Dvorak. Takes the feet at the back end. Oh, there's a great stop by Kakanen. Absolutely levels him! Savard's pass was so difficult, James. I mean, he stumbles and he's off balance, and he's still able to corral the puck and get it off with precision to the shooter. That leads to a great scoring chance. Oh, he hit him and caught all of it. Oh, and that's a tough one, James. You're along the boards. They don't have a lot of give. What that means, you're feeling it all. Koonin's got it against the boards. Oh, and it stays out. He got a piece of that one. Here's a short pass to Matheson. The Canadians are on the attack. The Sharks scoop it up along the boards. Slides it across to Couture. And now he tries to get it across to Eklund. Handles the puck. Long jam in front, that's broken up. San Jose's gained possession along the boards. And that's broken up. From the left side, he moves it up ahead. Montreal's got the puck against the half wall. Quick pass to Granlin. All alone! He scores! Oh, wow, what a finish! Well, I love that he used his speed and didn't slow down, James. And it's all about patience and composure, outgaining the goaltender, finding the room and burying it. But this breakaway is perfectly executed. 
executed, James. He knows his bread and butter is his great shot. He sees an opening and he takes it. San Jose is taking a two-goal lead already here in the first period. They look dominant tonight, Cheryl. Yeah, they've been terrific tonight, James, and they've been able to execute. They've thrown a lot of pucks to the net, but they've managed it extremely well. They've opened up their own lanes and they've got the opportunities. Montreal's cut it along the wall. Oh, a clutch save! Pokes it away to keep the pressure on. San Jose is moving it into the offensive end. Aims his own along the right wall. Throws it in. Battling for it along the boards. Quick feed to Declare. From the back of the cage with the puck. Huge steal in his own end. Montreal's got the puck at the defensive end. San Jose's got control of it now from their own end. Great reach with the poke check. And the puck's booted away. The Canadians will play it in their own end. Looking for space inside the D zone. Goes right to the crease! Big save in front. And this is a dialed-in goaltender. Very aware, knows where the shooter is in that low slot, and makes the save. Moves it to Gallagher. And a nice takeaway in the defensive end by Addison. The Sharks have been playing great defensively. Their six are in the right position, but they need to make good on them. This game is off the coast. Score! of this period. The Sharks are taking control of this one, now leading by three. The Canadians win the faceoff. He got all of that one. Moves it quickly over to Cooley. Great on-ice awareness to bat it down. The Sharks will play it in their own end. Picked up along the wall by Stern. Battle along the boards. Takes a shot! Well, that's number two, Palmer. Yeah, he's been all over the puck tonight. He's feeling it. He's confident. You gotta believe he's gonna be looking for the hat. Smart play by the shooter here. The presence of mind to recognize that there's a lot of traffic and put it to the net. The goaltender, I mean, he can't see this puck, James. We can't see where it is with all of these bodies net front, and it finds the back of the net. Centers glide into the dot as a face-off ready to resume play. win the draw here in the neutral zone. Takes a shot. Oh, great save and a beauty on the play. Vlasic's taking it from his own end. Fires it on net. Turned aside with the glove by Allen. Braylon's playing with such confidence right now, and he's got this point streak going. And when that's happening for you, you're having a ton of fun putting up the points. Gets a hold of the puck. The Sharks gonna work on offense. Sends a pass over. Here's a short pass to Smith. Oh, and he somehow got a little piece of it, and it stays out of the net. Love the way the goaltender gets tight to the shooter here. The puck's in the low slot. You want to take away time, you want to take space? Goaltender does it, makes the save. Here in the late goings of the period, the Sharks are on the cusp of making this a blowout, leading by four. Puck scooped up by Vlasic. Here they come on the attack. Puts it on net. Great use of the stick to poke it away. And the puck's not loose. Picks off the pass. There's the buzzer. Fans seem to enjoy that first 20 minutes. We'll get to the second period right after both teams get a chance to catch their breath. Stick around. Both teams back on the ice. They're lined up, and period number two is about ready to go. It was 
There's quite the one-sided tilt in the first 20 minutes. Let's see if that continues here in the second. Well, Cheryl, already a third of this one played. What do you make of this one? One-on-one -on -one with the goaltender. He scores! Oh, wow, what a play! Well, he uses his speed to break away from his opponent and reads exactly what the goaltender is giving him to be able to convert. What a beautiful play. Well, he's in all alone on the breakaway. Not a lot of back pressure. He has more time. What a beautiful move in tight to beat the tender. Great patience to be able to finish that one off. Montreal's got to find a way to build on this now. This is the time. It certainly is, James, and that's something to build off when you get a goal. You can't sit idly by like you have all game. You have to find a way to execute and create some momentum and more offense if they want to get back in the game. Here's a pass to the middle. Great poke check on the reach. San Jose's got the puck here in the open ice. And he takes the feed. And rings the iron! The Sharks have been on the right side of the puck in this game, James, and they'd be in the lead by an extensive amount if they could just find the back of the net. I mean, man, how many times have they hit the post? Hurdles got it into offensive territory. Eklund's had such an impressive night offensively. You know that's his wheelhouse as he loves to have the puck on his stick. He creates, he's confident with it. And he's got a multi-point game. The Sharks are in transition. And that's knocked away by Savard. Quick pass to Anderson. Carries the puck through the neutral zone. And that's poked away by Vlasic. Grabbed along the board by Anderson. Big time saving goal as he gets all of it with the stick. A timely save is everything to your team, and this goaltender, he bails his team out. And that's broken up with a stick in front. Great reach by Eklund. Takes the feed in the middle of the ice. Fires it, and a great save! Kakanen's had a solid night between the pipes, James. I mean, he's done everything he could to stop the puck, as indicated by his save percentage, but his team has also been really strong. Got the confidence of their netminder, and they've created a ton of opportunities. Getting closer to the halfway point of this frame. A lot of offense in this one, mostly from one side. We've got 4-1 the score. Offense his own face off and he wins the draw. Oh, what a denial by Allen. Quick feed to Pearson. Centering feed. Oh, he comes up with a stop. Montreal's got the puck along the wall. Oh, look at this chance. Scores! And look at this. Suddenly they're right back into it. I really like their response here, James. They're able to capitalize on the opportunity and it gets them within two. And this two goal deficit, it almost feels like there's a little hope now in the game. And if they can get one more, you'll recognize that the momentum will completely shift. The Canadians desperately needed that one here. They did, and one of the key elements for them to have success is to support the puck. Feel like they've been isolated a lot in this game, but a lot of runway left over a period to play in order to get back in. Hoffman's taking it from his own end. And that's picked up by Pearson. Oh, and it just scores! And that's three unanswered goals. And as my mom likes to say, they're cooking with gas. <laughs> they're cooking with gas. And you can expect that they have put their opponents on their heels. This is a team that knows that they have worn their opponent down. Now they got to keep the pedal to the metal. Montreal suddenly made this a lot more intriguing here in this second period. I know it's cliche, James, but the game is 60 minutes. It's only the second, and they've got themselves within one. A lot of runway to go. San Jose's won the draw, and they take possession here in the open ice. Puck picked up by Gallagher. Gaining momentum up along the side. Shot, and he gets just enough to keep it out. Knocked away. The Canadians pick up steam and are on the attack. And he can't hang on after that hit. Taken along the wall by Dvorak. The Canadians gain possession. Hammers 
Appreciation for that huge save, and man, does this ever feel good. You know, you feel it right through you when you know you've made that big save, and everyone around you is appreciative. Oh, absolutely hammers him. Works it across to Anderson. Through the neutral zone, moving the puck along the side. A little crash and banging forces the turnover. Moves it to Koenig, and he gets a piece of that one and denies it. Sends a pass in front, and it's blocked. Up along the wing. Pokes it away in his own end. Tenacious battle for the puck along the wall. Here he is in close. Ferraro's got the puck now in his own end. Rocked him in the open ice. Shot. Here's a shot. And he catches that one with the glove. Midway mark of the frame. San Jose's got a one goal lead here. They're up 4 3. The Sharks win the draw. And that carries off a body in the lane. And a great read to turn that play aside. Teams are lined up, and we are ready to take this draw. The Canadians get a hold of the puck in their own end. Moves it quickly over to Caulfield. San Jose's got a hold of it against the wall. And now it's to Vlasic. Retreats with the puck inside the defensive zone. And he coughs it up with the pass. Made the stop on the play. Quick pass over to Couture. From the right wing, he moves it to the middle. Spectacular save on the play. Along the right side into the offensive zone. Oh, and he misses on a great eight-plus score chance there. Well, he's right exactly where he wants to be. He's got the puck on his stick, just unable to put it in the mesh. Now lining up here for the face-off after a great shift there, Cheryl. Yeah, in the offensive zone, they have all Momentum would be surprised to see a little stall at the faceoff here to give their goaltender a little extra breather because he has been under siege and you can see it on his face. He needs some rest. Oh, that's a true competitor's save. Just when you think that he's completely out of it, James, he comes across with a desperation. Oh, what a save on the play! Oh, that's such an athletic save, James. I mean, that's just all about completely finding a way to get to the puck. the pass. Textbook poke check by Matheson. Takes the feed. Drives it to the crease. Scores! Don't call it a comeback, but it sure is. Well, I like the effort and intangibles to their game tonight, James. I mean, it has been an uphill battle as they found themselves down in this game. They continue to battle to chip away. They were urgent on the puck, and now they find themselves getting the equalizer. The Canadians have set this up to be a dramatic one tonight. They put themselves in a good position here at the end of the second period. Isn't it ain't easy to get goals in this game, but they got the equalizer, and it's a nice step heading into the third period. Ducks won the draw at center. And they'll dump it in. Solid hit on the play, and that knocks the puck off his stick. And they continue to apply pressure here. Second intermission approaching quickly here. San Jose's got it in their own zone. The Sharks take it along the wing. There's a collision with some authority. Centering feed. And he shuts down a great scoring chance there. There's 
the buzzer, bringing the second period to an end. You don't want to go home yet, do you? Third period action still to come. All right, fans, time for tonight's Lucky Road giveaway. Congratulations to Section 107 Road S. Each fan receives a Welcome back to EA Sports. The final frame looms here as the officials set to drop the puck on period number three. It has been an offensive fireworks display here tonight, and I would expect it to continue here in the third. The Canadians have it against the wall. Looking dangerous as they move along the boards. The Sharks have it in the offensive zone. What a stop with the paddle by Allen. We're still in the early stages of this period. We are all tied up in this one. And they take possession here in the offensive zone and time to go on the attack. And that was a good heads-up read to make that save. And that's deflected. Too much congestion in front. Great read with the stick. And now he moves it quickly to Addison. Puts it up and he hits the And the deadlock is broken as they take the lead. Well, that's a huge shift. You can see everyone standing up on the bench. They know how much it means, but it's the next shift that matters most now, James. You want to kind of push and put pressure on your opponent when they're down. James, these are the kind of pesky goals that create a ton of energy for your team. The rebound pops out after the shot. You have to have the hard stick heavy on it with it on the ice, battling to compete for it. He does it and he buries it. The Sharks now have the lead here in period number three, and it's crunch time now. It is crunch time, and it's crush time, James. I mean, it's been back and forth all game. Now you find yourself in the lead, so you have the momentum. You've killed your opponents, so continue to hold it, continue to apply the pressure. Moves the puck. And it's a quick pass to Matheson. Oh, a tremendous save on the play! What an incredible save. No idea how he got to that one, James. And the shooter is absolutely stunned. What a stop. And these fans are still pressing the puck. What we just saw. What a save that was, Sharon. Yeah, he made an incredible save. And really, and he's got a step. What a save on the play. Of this team trying to outweigh the goal, kind of real patient, real composed, but guess what? So is the goal who makes the save. The Sharks have been the more active squad offensively tonight, and they lead it early in this third period. Couture's won the draw, and they're on the attack. And that's off target as it hits a body. Headman pass. And now it's grabbed by Doc. Picks off the pass. Slides it over with pace to Addison. Moves it in front. And that's intercepted. Gallagher's moving it ahead. Here's a shot with the stop. Knocked away in the offensive zone. Here's a short pass to Eklund. Takes the puck. Great save by Allen. Still a lot of time left in the period as we approach the midway mark. San Jose's got a 5-4 lead here in what has been a thrilling display of offense. Moves the puck across to Evans. Gaining momentum along the boards. And lowers the boom with a big time hit. Well, this is a message sending hit, isn't it? When you get all of your opponent and you're able to separate the body from puck, you know you've done your job. Message delivered. No quarter given here as they battle for the loose puck along the boards. Quick pass to Harris. Here's a chance. Allen's got it, and he's going to hang on as we get a whistle. Well, he's been dialed in right from puck drop, and he has been under siege, James. Nice job to hold on to that puck. Now they can hit the reset button. San Jose's motor has been non-stop tonight. Lots of shots on net, and they lead in the third. Slides it on over to Caulfield. Slittering feed! Picked off in front. Gains the zone on the left wing. Slittering feed! And that's stopped! Goaltender covers it up. We get a whistle to slow things down. 
Puck possession so critical in today's game, and the official ready to drop the puck right here. Montreal's got the win off that draw. The Canadians move it in. Here's a chance. Oh, they didn't get all of it, but just enough to keep it out of the net. Another stop by the goaltender. stretch one mistake either way will be the difference maker the canadians gain control of the puck against the wall quick pass across to doc gains the zone takes a bump but still hangs on to the puck oh and it goes off his glove the sharks have it now san jose's got a hold of the puck oh he hammered him oh uh, he knew exactly what he was doing going into this along the boards james i love that it was a clean hit he finishes it off perfectly fantastic save captain ends in the right spot at the right time just a brilliant save great defensive effort with the stick san jose's looking to break out quick feed to ferraro san jose's got the puck along the wall redirected off a stick Official blows the play dead as the puck goes out of bounds. Well past the midway mark of this period, it's a one-goal hockey game in what has been a fantastic display of offense. It's 5-4. That was amazing! What a save by Allen! San Jose's got the puck. Tremendous save by Allen! I don't think anybody was hanging on to the puck after that hit. on and off his stick in a hurry and it needs to be from that low zone slot area James just beats the goaltender because he gets off his stick so fast the Sharks are now up by two here in the back half of this third period man this is a good position to be in uh, it's the best position to be in and you don't want to give any life to your opponents you have to make sure that you're pounding pucks you're on them first listen if you're four checking they don't get the puck Attack. Shot! And he's got that one. The Canadians gain possession along the wall. Good read with the stick to break that up. Handles the pass from the right wing. Moves the puck along oh. the half wall. I know I stepped on your toes there, James, but had to react to that massive hit. San Jose's got it in the neutral zone. The Sharks get a hold of the puck along the boards. And the shot dies in the traffic jam. Allen's last save is one that's going to be remembered for a while, James. It's going to be on the highlight reel. It's on one of mine now. I mean, he stole one there. It was all but in. And that desperation and compete level, it makes the save. Scooped up along the wall by Gallagher. He's got a little jump. All alone. What a save. And the puck stopper hangs on to get a breather here for the team. San Jose is looking to close things out here late in this third period as they continue to lead. They win the draw and go on the attack. Steps in front of it for the block. His reflexes on display tonight. It's amazing to me how he always looks like he's in the right position because he tracks and reads the play so well. And this time he gets in front of the puck that's right in the middle of the ice as the shooter's got a dangerous opportunity. A big draw looming here in the offensive zone. And with the centers tied up, he swoops in to take possession.
playing almost like they want a day off here tomorrow, Cheryl. Yeah, I'd say so, and you always look forward to a day off, and this coaching staff has got to be impressed with this team tonight. You know, the ability to get the puck to net, driving the pace of play, and just having really great habits, consistent effort right through the game. Too much traffic in the lane. Oh, and they go back on offense. Oh, so good. Oh, my goodness, what a stop. Oh, that's unbelievable, James. I have no idea how he got to that puck. It's some gymnastics at its finest. Takes the feed in the middle of the neutral zone. Takes a shot. Takes a shot. Oh, what a close save there. San Jose's offense has not been a problem tonight. They put a lot of shots on net and lead a big time late in this third period. Ducks got it, and they'll go on the attack here in the offensive zone. And loses possession after a solid hit. Sorry.